grew up with three boys. I'm the baby. I always wanted a baby sister. My mom used to say stories like when I was a kid, you know, we would see a little girl in a stroller. I'm like, mommy, I want one just like that. Oh, and she would start laughing and she'd be like, you know, you know what? She goes, we're not having any more kids because if we had another kid, it's probably going to be a boy. I don't mm -hmm. know. Like, and we just, we just don't want any more kids. I said, okay. She goes, but when you get married, you can have as many kids as you want. They can be as many girls as you want. Mm -hmm. So kind of from a really young age, I kind of always wanted to be a dad, right? Yeah. But it wasn't like, obviously, I wasn't going to try and wrong. Mm -hmm. you know, in high school, trying to have babies and all that kind of stuff too. Yeah. But it was kind of thing when you found the right person, it was like, yeah, I just kind of like settled. And I think I really started to come into wanting to be a dad in like mid twenties, mid twenties, eh? mid twenties. But then that doesn't nothing. And I'll say this over again. I talked to new parents and nothing prepares you to be a dad. And so even when you're holding the baby in your arms, because then all of a sudden one day, like, uh, you know, you're only going to spend the hospital mm -hmm. for whatever, like overnight or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. And they're like, okay, you can take your daughter home. And we're like, what do you mean? <laughs> like, I'm where are you going to be? I'm like, bringing this human back home. Exactly. Now, yeah. now you know you're responsible for this mm -hmm. human being. It's like, shit. <laughs> you know, it's like, it's kind of scary. And like, and and that's where your partner comes in. 